Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn how to generate DDL, data definition language script, such as create from a SQL Server Management Studio. So think about that. You are working as a SQL Server developer or a DBA, and then a request comes for you. And let's say you, you have another colleague, he's, he's saying, hey, you are working on this database. Can you give me the definition of these tables or maybe one table? So connect to the server, then go to the database, and then go to that table. Right click on that one and uh, script the table as and create the definition for him. So you will be creating a create definition or statement for him and just email him or whatever the way you want to deliver now the next part if he will ask you hey can you send me the ddl or create statement for five tables out of 100 tables so now what you will do every time you click here then you will create the script and that that's a lot of work so that that you don't want to do it the next part what we can do here once we are in the database we can go to the view and object explorer detail so that's fine once we are there click on the tables and you will see all those tables there let's select these tables and then we can select all of them by pressing the shift and then we will right click here and then script as and create a new query window so this is how we will script multiple tables of our choice for other dbs or developers and we can share with them now if a person is asking can you provide me the definition for tables such as five tables and 10 store procedures and some views from this database so in this case what you will do so you will come back first we, we created the script for tables you go back go to views and now you will script the views so you will be creating the script for the view and then you will be coming back to the object explorer detail again and going to the pro programmability and then here you will be going to store procedures and selecting that there so you will select all of them and create the definition for him now you see that there are multi steps are involved here so every time for each of the type of objects so you will be going back to the folders and creating the create script for the for the other developer or the dba or any team member so that's also time consuming you have to go for each different tables views um, and store procedures uh, and other different uh, objects uh, you might want to maybe uh, you, you might uh, want to ignore that part and come to another solution where you can select all the objects in one uh, place and then create the scripts and give him one uh, uh, SQL file so let's cancel this out we say okay we are not interested to go one type of objects and create that we would like to create uh, for entire database so you go to the sales database or any database what you like and then go to task and here you will go to generate scripts so this wizard will help you to select all tables and on single cl clicks so you will be creating the scripts for multiple or different type of objects so hit next first thing is select the entire database objects so that's great if somebody is asking hey i want all the uh, object definition such as store procedure functions uh, views uh, so you can leave this one as it is and uh, hit next uh, but if somebody say okay I would like to get uh, some maybe from here there is some schema sales and all that I would like to only get sales schema objects so fine click on the tables and select the tables what are required go to view and uh, select the views and then uh, go to the store procedures so, so this is how you will be selecting a uh, different type of objects uh, and uh, then hitting next uh, now you can save the scripts uh, to different locations uh, and here provide the location whatever or wherever or you can uh, uh, save to the clipboard or you can save to the new query window let's open to the new query window and uh, see how it works uh, now this is summary you will see all the tables whatever you have selected uh, hit next uh, and now it is telling you i am generating those uh, scripts uh, and hit finish and you see that a new window is open with the create definition of all those uh, objects uh, whatever we have uh, selected uh, now you can just uh, save our email and uh, whatever you like with this uh, uh, entire sql queries uh, you can give to your other fellows and share with them or if you would like to create a new database and create these objects you can do that this is a one of the way when somebody asks you hey i want to create a brand new database without any data so this is one way where you create all the 
uh, scripts for entire database and run those on the newly created database the only part you have to change uh, this part use sales as it is using sales database you will be creating a new database let's say you will create another sales one and then change to the sales one and run the script so all these objects will be created in that database so thanks very much for watching this video and i will see you guys in next video